so hello my dear students uh, in this flip video i will discuss about the most important concept which is used in database management system that is locks so question arises in mind what is lock lock is nothing it is a variable which is associated or linked with data item so any data item may have a lock in the form of a variable right or we can say that uh, lock uh, may be defined as the status of a data item on which we can perform various operations various operations means we can perform write operation on it we can perform read operation on it or we can perform update operation on it so it defines the status of data item on which various operations or instructions can be applied or implemented so types of locks uh, there are two types of locks number one is called shared lock which is represented by s and second is called exclusive lock which is represented by x so let us discuss uh, these one by one number one shared lock shared lock uh, is also known as read only lock uh, it means that uh, whenever we have any data item a if we are implementing read only lock on data item a suppose a is a data item then we can only read that data item a we cannot implement any other operations like write or update on data item a so uh, it can be implemented as lock as a lock as a means a is a data item on which lock is implemented in shared mode it means this data item a can be only read on read only right second is called exclusive lock it is represented by x so in this both read and write can be possible on data item it means we can implement read and write operations on data item suppose data item is a so it can be implemented as lock x on b so this line means here b is a data item suppose b is a data item on which we can implement an exclusive lock x right it means this data item b can both can be read and can be write so there is uh, one matrix which is known as lock compatible matrix so in this we have uh, a shared lock and exclusive lock so this matrix indicate that suppose there is one transaction having a shared lock on a data item right then another transaction can also implement shared lock on that data item that is yes okay but if one transaction has shared lock and another transaction has exclusive lock on a data item then it cannot be implemented it cannot be implemented in this format similarly if one transaction has exclusive lock and another transaction requires shared lock on data item then it is also not possible and finally if one transaction has an exclusive lock on a data item and another transaction has also an exclusive lock on a data item then this condition is also not, not possible so it means that any number of transactions can hold shared locks on data item but if any transaction holds an exclusive lock on data item then it is important to note that no other transaction may hold any lock on that data item that is much more clear from this figure right this is called lock compatible matrix next there are two types of locks in it number one is called upgrade lock and number two is called downgrade lock so let us understand this number one upgrade so uh, suppose uh, before starting with upgrade and uh, downgrade locks let us uh, understand this with the help of this definition suppose if uh, transaction holds a lock on a data item a uh, holds a lock it may be a shared lock it may be an exclusive lock on data item a then it can be allowed to change the lock from one state to another by using two conditions only number one condition is called upgrade and number two condition is called downgrade so in upgrade condition what we have if transaction holding a shared lock on data item a then then lock as a can be upgraded to lock x a it means uh, on data item a shared lock can be upgraded to exclusive lock on data item a it means it can be upgraded from shared lock to exclusive lock only when your transaction holding shared lock on a data item a for example uh, second is called downgrade so when transaction no longer required to write 
on a data item there may be certain conditions where transaction does not required anything to be write on a data item then we can uh, use log x a that can be downgraded to log s a it means that exclusive log on data item can be downgraded to the shared log on data item x right 